what are demons? Well, in short, they're fallen angels. And we read this in Isaiah 14 and Revelation chapter 12 that when Lucifer fell from heaven, he took a host of angels with him and those came to be known as demons. Well, what sort of power do demons have? No more power than an angel might have. Sometimes we blow the enemy out of proportion. We get scared about what Satan might do to us. But let us never forget that Satan is just a fallen angel, nothing more. The Bible tells us in John's epistle that the evil one cannot touch us. Do you believe that? That's the truth because you're sealed with the Holy Spirit. The enemy is all bark and no bite. Why? Well, because he can do nothing but accuse us and lie to us. It's his message that is the concern. But he can't actually touch us or harm us. Maybe you've wondered if a believer can be possessed by a demon. No, certainly not, because we are people of God's own possession, and God won't share us with a demon. What is salvation? God cleaned house, and He moved in to the very core of our being, and we are protected by the Holy Spirit forever. So, what is a demon? It's a fallen angel, nothing more. Should we be scared of demons? No, we can fix our eyes on Jesus, the author and perfecter of our faith, and as we walk by the Spirit, we're not going to fulfill the desires of the enemy anyway. Our focus is Jesus every day and always.